Has anyone tried a Vesti Isabel comp? Like with volume or litter and then Dala. You know what? I think this team might actually be onto something. Because you're bursting so fast. Hmm. Hmm. Bro, my litter is damaged. <laughs> <laughs> My litter did more damage than Isabel. <laughs> How did litter out DPS Isabel? Oh, um, because Isabel doesn't have a gear, I think. Yeah. <laughs> okay, 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 but hear me out. Vesti, though? But uh, that's without gears on Vesti. Alright, alright, fine. Here, here. Real run, real run. Let's give them gears. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Chat, you know what? I feel like Vesti's a secret sleeper. I feel like we all meme on her, but... With fast charge? I feel like... I feel like with fast charge, she would actually be OP. And proper team. So maybe volume. Oh my god, crit. Oh yeah, she's crit, huh? Third team, volume with Vesti. Pog? Because Vesti scales with crit. And volume does crit buffs. Kind of like how Alice is OP. Because you don't really need to full charge with her. I feel like Vesti is OP because you also can do this. And you don't need to full charge with her. And the fact that you can really burst so much. I want I want to see how much count how much burst have we done. Jesus. Can we do like a can we do a tally up counter here? How many times have we bursted? No. If you manual burst, it goes faster. Yeah, I guess. And this is the real test. If you manual spam burst, you could get get two more bursts in three minutes. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, that sounds good and all. But let's see something. All right, we're gonna compare her DPS compared to our Modernia, because um, we're getting the buffs from litter. I'd say even every ten seconds, we probably have like a fifty percent uptime on litter. Litter's full burst buff. All right, chat. Do the do the count, okay? Guys, do the count. How many bursts they are? Drake's not bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, we're testing just we're just testing Vesti's damage. That's why. And I want to point out how underskilled my Vesti is. You're we're comparing a Vesti that doesn't have any skill ups versus Modernia. That has 10, 10, 10 on skills. And uh, an overload also. Yeah, you you pretty much have litter's buff like 50% uptime. Same with I mean tech and dollars buff also. Oh, my mother is dying. Seventeen and eighteen at the last second. Okay. So that's like six per minute. Once every ten seconds. So yeah, basically fifty percent uptime, right? Yeah, basically fifty percent uptime of litter's buff. Same with Dala's buff, 50% uptime. Putting it to context, my Isabel has 5, 4, 3, 4, 1, 4.
My Vessi had 1-1-1. And my Modernia had 5-5-5. Five, five, five. With 10, 10, 10. And what's the damage difference? Man. The thing is, like, I think the same rule kind of applies with Vesti the same way as how it applies with Alice. They don't rely on full bursting to make full good use of their kit and to this boss i guess you don't really need the skill one on vesti because skill one on vesti has its only explosion range so that doesn't really and eh, we were hitting both regardless so we don't need the explosion range but then we could scale up way better more with these you know what i wrote down on union raid team comp dang who did not read this huh who did not read this? Oh man. Man, if only there was like a Union Raid team comp guide that was gonna tell me what are the good teams to use. Oh man. Oh man. Would've been crazy, huh? Let's add this. Dang. Uh, the 10 second burst. <laughs> team. <laughs> So what if we 444 Vesti and then compare it again? I wonder if she will out damage her. Oh my god, oh my god, wait. <laughs> I should have been I should have been aim assisting this whole time, I think. Damn. She's get, she's inching closer now. Too. Cause like with 111 on her skill, and then I push her to 444. She went from 94 mil to 105 mil. So she gained in in five level or in four level well no three levels. She gained 10 mil. Yeah, because uh, I mean it's just roughly the same amount. Uh my Moderna did more damage because she was doing a little bit more core hits this time around because I, I did I turned on the uh aim assist and so it, she did a little bit more uh and otherwise see isabel did the same amount of damage 54 uh and litter and my litter and dala did roughly the same a little bit higher there and a little bit higher there probably because of the core shots as well and it makes sense that Isabel did not deal more damage because she wasn't doing core shots. But in like 10, in 3 levels, Vesti gained about 10 mil damage from level 1 to level 4. Good stuff. The downside here is like obviously you're using 2 cooldown reduction unit. But now, but with more and more teams, uh, losing, uh, with more and more teams having cooldown reduction probably in the future because right now we had oh sakura also right sakura has a cooldown reduction on burst also so like more and more units are going to have cooldown reductions and i can expect we can expect litter and dala to be probably another combination that we can use with kind of this this kind of theme with cooled full burst reduction time cold reduction Isabel and Vesti and people might be wondering like oh you're not bursting with Modernia well in fact it's actually stronger Modernia actually is stronger if she doesn't burst in some scenarios and this is one of these scenarios because you're full burst we're, we're full bursting a lot more consistently so the overall damage is going to be bigger also so that's something to keep in mind because because we're full bursting a lot more yeah, this is 18 full bursts in 3 minutes, which is basically every 10 seconds we are full bursting, which means that we have 50% uptime on Litter's buff, same with Dala, 50% uptime as well. And yeah, this is the raw rocket launcher damage without, you know, without affected by skill. And I want to know if 
we're just dealing a lot of damage because we were using rocket launcher not because um vesti is strong okay so the raw damage from rocket launcher is basically 50 mil because we use power manually we're not really getting any of her stacks or anything because remember how for vesti we did about a hundred five mil and now she did 51 mil that means she lost about 55 mil and power did 58 mil here which sounds about right basically when you're manual bursting this kind of comp will get a lot better once we have better cooldown reduction unit or there's some unit with giga strong buff on burst pretty much yeah because <clears throat> uh, right now we're using both litter and dala in this same team and i mean alternatively you can use volume and dala right but the issue with that is like if you use volume with dala now where's your attack buff coming from right that's another thing to question so you need like some good balance between volume and dala and or litter dala and these are the only th actually no uh there's four sakura is also a cooldown reduction unit but the downside with sakura is she is a 40 second burst one and so that means that you're gonna need another burst one unit to go along with her and maybe she might work out fine i actually don't i actually can see it being fine if she has another if there's another 40 second burst one unit you could pair her with sakura because sakura does have an attack buff for the whole ally as well so it's not she's not it's not the worst if she bursts uh on as a secondary as long as we have another burst one that's 40 second that gives good attack buff i think that would be good and no i'm not talking about milk because milk's burst is more heals and like she 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 does buff but it's only it's tense every 10 seconds every 20 seconds for 10 seconds technically it is kind of good and she does heal and maybe i guess maybe you might need her heal maybe maybe uh, but in any case though, um, this is not what I was thinking when I'm thinking of attack buff. I'm thinking someone that is bursting for a good amount. But maybe, hey, maybe, maybe you could you could pair milk with Sakura. It's not the bad thing. But yeah, right now it's just because we don't have a lot of a lot of burst cooldown reduction units. That's why it's hard to recommend this team just yet. Or in particular, it's a 5 second burst, full burst unit. So Isabel, Vesti, Mihara. Mihara. The, the 5 second burst. So right now, I guess we will see. Uh, yeah, this one has full burst reduction for 5 seconds. I think, I think this team will be nice. Once we get more units that are cooldown reduction and with decent buffs as well. But right now it's kinda hard to <laughs> find them. So Personally I wouldn't use this team on a union raid mainly because like I would want to save I want to save litter for another team, right? Like, you know, I have my Scarlet, I have my Valernia. Uh, I have uh, or you could go with Alice or Maxwell so it's just it, it just feels kind of like a waste to use litter on this on this team but I guess like maybe if you're doing allocation so like you're if you're a bot if you're a specialist on sunbait or like termite B for example like we, we you could assign some people using their litter teams on maybe on uh, on Thermite B instead and maybe because right now I oh yeah I actually I did like 600 mil right with done team but then if another guy could do 600 mil yeah basically only wasted two teams to destroy Thermite B and now you don't have to have other people use their team at all 
So that's a pro and con. You could have someone use their litter on Termite B, and then other people use their Team Two, Team Team Three into Sinister, and then other people with litter specialist on Nihilister, and then maybe another Team Two, Team Three on Sunbather, and then another litter on Altaizen or Miranda team. So or, or with Snow White, right? So it's just a it's a matter of allocation and that's something that you have to figure out on the fly with Union Raid because uh, you know as time progresses early on it's hard to figure out how to allocate the teams because the bosses are, are so weak but then as you the time goes on later it becomes more apparent like okay how do we allocate this team how do I allocate which one is better yeah and yeah if there's like chatterbox and union raid definitely this one would definitely be good 